channel so guys in this video we will see how to fix pantair pool heater error codes what are the meaning behind them causes and their troubleshooting steps okay so guys um, pantair pool heater sometimes shows the different codes on the screen of your heater and we will know the meaning of them what are the causes and then troubleshooting steps for them so first of all error codes err pressure switch open um, it means uh, the pressure switch is open indicating insufficient water flow through the heater so the chances that uh, of this problem is that the clogged filters closed valves and malfunctioning pump or faulty pressure switch how you gonna resolve this problem is ensure the pool pump is operating correctly clean or replace dirty filters or check for any obstructions into your heater verify that all the valves are open and allowing proper water flow and inspect the pressure switch for defects and replace if it is necessary also make sure that if uh, the ERR uh, pressure switch open is showing you have to make sure before checking all these things your heater is turned off do not inspect any part of your heater while it is into the power switch the another error code is ERR HLS high limit switch open as you can see it is showing here its meaning the high limit switch is opened due to excessive water temperature when the water temperature rises excessively this shows okay and the causes is a low water flow faulty thermal regulator or defective high limit switch and how are you going to troubleshoot with this is check for adequate water flow and clean filters if needed time to time cleaning filter is one of the most prominent step you can take okay inspect and if necessary replace the thermal regulator okay and then test the high limit switch for proper operation and replace if it faulty the uh, another error code is err afs air flow switch open its meaning the air flow switch is open indicating an issue with the blower or venting system the causes of them might be blocked vents malfunctioning blower a defective air flow switch how you gonna troubleshoot simply ensure all the intake air intake and exhaust ones are clear of obstruction no dirt and debris no no uh, obstruction that are keeping the exhaust vents working properly verify that the blower is functioning properly inspect the air flow switch and replace if defective the fourth error code is ERRIGM. It's ignition failure. It means a heater failed to ignite. The causes can be insufficient gas supply that it never get the gas enough to be ignited. Faulty igniter that your igniter is not working properly and there are faults in it. Or issues with the ignition control module. Okay. How are you gonna troubleshoot? Simply confirm that the gas supply is adequate and valves are open inspect the igniter for damage and replace if necessary check the ignition control module for faults and replace if needed <clears throat> another error code is err ags ags stands for automatic gas shut off it means the system has detected a fault and automatically shuts off your gas supply the causes can be overheating flame rollout or sensor malfunctions this is a safety measure that are done to make sure there are no further causes of that and the um, ways you can troubleshoot it is inspect for signs of overheating or flame rollout, ensure proper ventilation around the heater, test sensors for proper operation and replace if there is any fault and you find anything in between faulty. <coughs> and the, another error code is ERRSFS. SFS stands for stack flu sensor, meaning the stack flu sensor has detected temperatures exceeding safe limits. That the safe limits are caused by the temperature and now it is no more safe to keep on increasing the temperature the causes can be clogged exhaust suited heat exchanger or defective stack flue sensor how are you gonna troubleshoot simply check and clean the exhaust and air vents inspect the heat exchanger for shoot building up clean if necessary test the stack flue sensor and replace if you found it effective <coughs> another error code is E05 stack flu sensor open. It means the stack flu sensor circuit is open, indicating a possible sense of failure. The causes can be defective stack flu sensor or the wiring issues. And uh, the troubleshooting steps for it 
inspect the sac flu sensor and its wiring connections replace the sensor if it is found to be faulty another error code is e06 stack flu sensor shorted it means the stack flu sensor circuit is shorted and the cause of it can be defective sensor and same the wiring problems the troubleshooting steps examine the sensor and wiring for shorts or damage replace the sensor if necessary r13 and r14 codes it means these codes are part of startup routine and not error indications the actions you can take is no action is required unless the heater fails to operate after displaying these codes okay so this is for r13 and e06 <coughs> and the error code e01 and 126 shows the water temperature sensor open it means the water temperature sensing circuit is open or faulty the causes can be defective temperature sensor or wiring issues troubleshooting steps test the temperature sensor with a multimeter it should read 100 ohms at 77 degree fahrenheit or in celsius it's 25 degree replace the sensor if readings are incorrect okay so guys thanks for watching i hope this video is helpful for you thank you for watching